Good day, everyone. Rich from A3 Sky Warrior. Today, I wanted to wrap up Cottonwood pretty much from last... Was it last weekend? <laughs> yeah, that weekend went really quick. Of course, I was on hardly any sleep that week. Trying to get everything done around here and everything else going on. But, um, wanted to get this out earlier. But, um, trying to clean up some projects and help my son with another project. Made a Nice workbench for his garage out of uh, scrap lumber. All right, let's get to this. Um, yeah, it was a really great time. Great meeting everyone again. Um, yeah, uh, Mega Dog sent uh, Chris with some beer, brewskis for us. He didn't get out till later for some reason. And, uh, it was great missing meeting Chris and Jess. Also, um, somewhere in Ohio, hooked me up. He's big red, and um, well, I got a bunch of some goodies here. <laughs> this was my duck. Yeah, it's Polish. It probably came in last. I don't know what. I didn't win the duck race. Did get a the red poker chip from Wrench. The Cotton, the Freedom Fest from Scott Sharp, Grandma Kelly. I think I gave, got her some honey. The PA Patriot. Got me a pay dirt. Appreciate it, brother. I gave him some honey also. Um, Craig, guy that got our dredge from, Brian, Indiana Creek Gold. Um, I think he was out in Arkansas. Got some, well, I, I showed some of that in my last video, but uh, I was able to get one, give that to my granddaughter so she could play with. Also, this is a nice one. He's all cleaned up. I'm going to put it over here in the back somewhere. I'm so terrible with names. Um, yeah, Luke Duke Outdoors gave me some nice marbles. This one, I can't remember what he said. Uh, this one reacts with UV light. Well, I'm on that one. Let's see if he can. No, oh, that's a. Uh, I think that's what they call a uh, Indiana ruby. It's not that great, but it does react in light. Did find one. I. Sure, I found another one. Um, got a little bit of shiny, not much. Uh, my buddy and I was just messing around with RPs a, a little bit here and there, a couple buckets. Wasn't really in the gold. I'm going to put that in some, uh, probably some glycerin in a little bottle so he can uh, show off his first Indiana gold. Not much there, but... <laughs> Uh, I wanted to do this first, but while I was at Cottonwood, I missed this, um, Golden Skull Prospecting, give me a bunch of stickers to hand out for my next giveaways, and other things coming up here, yeah, I gave him a card with um, some more stickers, Oh, thanks, Scott, sir. Before we get to um, what I found in fossils and stuff, also um, my next one coming up, if I can find... There it is. Sorry, this is kind of out of order. But Glenn's Adventures and Prospecting. I got to get to this pay dirt. Be getting to that next. And then... Um, I think, um, no, I didn't, <laughs> I don't have it out here, but, um, Brian Indiana Creek Gold got me a kilo bag from Mike Vendetta, um, so next one will be this one, Glenn's Outdoor Adventures, 
and then a kilo bag. But um, tomorrow is um, Tuesday. I had to use or lose some of my vacation hours. Don't not much, but was able to take off tomorrow to go to um, do some prospecting with Brian. Finally, we didn't even. Uh, yeah, the last time we went to the Love on Gold show, we didn't go to the. We didn't go out and prospect. I think it was December last time we went prospecting. So I'll take you guys outside real quick. Show you my little rock collection. But, okay, first. Yeah, I had these um, Freedom Fest ones. Um, I can't remember who it was that got my... I had a honey pay and some honey for the... For the tickets, I got. Hold on, I got it over here. Eminem prospecting. This is why I won their last flag, I believe, that was out there. They signed the back. <laughs> I'm really limited on space here. I don't know how I'm going to have this out. Uh, find a place in the background at least. All right. Let's go outside and finish this up with some rocks I found. All right. This is some of my rocks from the... From down at Cottonwood. Of course, this thing's not going to work today. Nope. <laughs> anyway, found this big horn coral. Got a couple other little ones. Yep. Bump. I can't see the glare. Of course, the sun's starting to come out. Now, this is some fossils in chert. This ain't gonna work, is it? No. Pretty cool. I ain't finding any trollobites. There's just a bunch of some horn coral in here. Shells. This one's pretty good. I never did find um went a long long my buddy and I went all along the rock wall and didn't find the place that I got the other fossil from. But this was the only one close. But I didn't find any others around there. So Some little baby crinoids in there. Little horn fossil again. That's pretty much the same. Not really good pieces by having for the yard or something. More little crinoids. Boy, the, of course the stupid rooster doesn't like me being out here. But I got some rocks to go on uh thought that it might cab out try cutting these up some have some pretty nice colors to them thought they might <laughs> stupid rooster thought I might cut these up in slabs that'll probably be just cold as to cut won't be able to slab that one That's definitely from Canada. I only got one possible geode. Not really a nice geode, probably. We'll see. I'm going to just cut this one out sometime. More little piece of, another piece of chert with some shells. Some of these have some nice colors to them. A 
lot of these won't cut. But I grabbed them anyway. Some of these have some really nice colors in there, but see how that one cuts up. Anyway, really fun trip. Hope to find some more over at Brian's tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, I got a rock problem. <laughs> more rocks is all I need, right? But anyway, you all have a blessed moral day. Hope your weekend went great. Um, Brian's is coming up here soon. Uh, after, well, while I'm doing this, he'll be um, coming out here in a few minutes this afternoon. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh, I showed that one. Okay. But remember all the fallen? Died in all of our wars. Um, remember today, my great uncle, Brenizer, died at Anzio. My dad and uncle. Both, uh, well, one is Korean War, I was served during um, Vietnam, I was a Russian sub hunter, so he didn't really do too much in that conflict. But well, you all have a blessed day, blessed week, and hope you guys see you, see you all on the creek sometime here. Have a good one.